our spring break, uh, we went down to Orlando, Florida. We, we uh, go back and forth from Orlando to uh, uh, Hilton Head Island, depending on the year. Uh, so we were in Orlando. Uh, we had six matches for the women. They went undefeated, and the guys played five matches. And the guys had a tough 24-hour schedule where they played three ranked teams in 24 hours, and they were able to come through. And that, that finished with a big, big win over Luther. Uh, which is one of our big rivals, so we beat them 5-4, which is a good way to end that 24-hour stretch. Um, in addition to the tennis, we had a couple of days where we allowed them to have a little bit of fun. We went to the beach one day, and the other day they went to the theme parks, like Universal. And, uh, well, it's really hard to pick one because there were just so many moments that were a ton of fun. If you're asking specifically about a tennis moment, I would say once we were all done with our matches and we realized that both teams went undefeated. I think that was pretty awesome, and that was definitely memorable. In addition, I always really like going to the beach, so that was another moment that stands out for me. I love the ocean. I think it, it makes it a lot more fun because a lot of times, especially in the fall, we're separated from most of our matches because we have a lot more. So the time when we really get to know the guys team better is spring break because we have so much time where we can just hang out whenever we want and we travel together. So I actually thought it was a lot of fun getting to know the guys team The better. best part of spring break this year was probably the Luther match as far as the tennis went. It was a battle, but uh, otherwise my favorite part was probably going to Universal too. It was a lot of fun. Um, I think our mental toughness improved with every match, and that was probably what let us beat Luther and Oglethorpe, because that was after a tough match earlier in the day, so that was big.